Hello, this is Hey. I watch your videos all the time. Oh, awesome. I'm like, is that him? These are already taken. Oh, okay, no problem. Sorry. No, no worries. Early birds. Let me get out and I'll get out of your way. I like those cables. Oh yeah, that would be cool. Put you over here. Yeah, sure. Thank you. Oh yeah, six bucks. I got these two right here. <laughs> She's doing the money. Alrighty. Yeah. There you go, man. What are we buying? I got the uh, poster and the okay. bottle. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck with the sale. Oh, thank you. All right, are you ready? How are you today? I saw this one's six. What are you asking for the smaller one? Uh, Chris, what do you want for your smaller one? Uh, I think I had uh, five on that one. Five on this one? Okay. I'm going to just kind of start a little pile here okay. if that's okay. Yep. Actually, we'll just put them on that table over there. Oh, yeah, sure. Up. I think I'm all. I think I'm all done. I think I'll go ahead and settle up with you. So I've got four and five is nine. Okay. Okay. And then I'm guessing these are three each. Okay. 
150. Three. Five. I think she said five. Yeah. Five. This one was six. Six. 3750? Does that sound right? Yeah, I think so. Okay. We'll just round up 38 to make it easy for you. Oh, I can give you 50 cents. I'm yeah, not worried about it. There you go. Great. Thank you so much. Do you want a bag for all this? If you got or... like a, bo a couple boxes yeah. for the snow globes, I just don't want them to get damaged. Here you go, you two dollars for that. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hello, this is Minnie Picker. Hey. I watch your videos all the time. Oh, awesome. I'm like, is that him? Yes. <laughs> What's your name? Katrina. Katrina, nice to meet you. You too. Oh, I'll Sorry. do left hand handshake there. <laughs> I'm like, I gotta say something. <laughs> yeah, thanks for saying hi. You're welcome. Are you finding stuff? Well, I just buy a couple things I have here three and there. Girls, so yeah. It's like, yeah, not really. <laughs> There's a lot around Mason. Oh, really? I've already hit like three or four around here. Oh, nice. Yeah. Yeah, I hit one. I forget what street that was. They didn't have nothing. Oh, really? Yeah, that's too bad. Yeah. <laughs> it was nice meeting you. Good luck you to you. Too. Thank you. Would you do 50 on these? Paige, I got paid for this one. Yeah. Okay, thank you. And I paid her for that little thing right there. There you go. Thanks. Thank you, ma'am. Good luck to you. Thank you. Oh, that Tonka truck is so cool. That is too neat. All right, I got two dollars for AJ. AJ, two dollars. There you go. Thank you. Thanks. All right, guys. It is now Monday morning. On Friday, I went to a handful of garage sales, and I got a lot of really good stuff. I got it pulled out. I'm gonna show you what I found. First sale of the day, I got two things: this Harry Potter poster for a dollar, and this vintage seltzer bottle for five. I've only found like one more of these over the years and these things do really good. The brand of this is Sparklets and I think I can get about 40 or 50 bucks for that on eBay. At another sale I got some snow globes and some like dinosaur decor that I took home that we're just going to put in my son's room. This one is Beauty and the Beast. Definitely keep an eye out for these guys because they sell for pretty good money. I've seen some out of the box go upwards of $100. This one I haven't comped out yet so I'm not sure what it's worth but I know it's a lot more than the $6 I paid for it. Got this Cinderella one with all the mice down below. This one is the Titanic. I thought that was pretty cool. And this is a San Francisco music box company. It's a wizard and a dragon. Last one I got is this 101 Dalmatians, but it like knocked up against one of the other ones and cracked as I was like bringing it inside. And it just like barely tapped it and the whole thing cracked. So that's unfortunate. We'll have to uh, pitch that one, but that one was going for like 40 bucks. Also got some books at that sale. Um, I was looking at the copyright dates on these, and they're both from like 1921 to like 1925, I think were the two dates. They're actually in really good condition for the age. I paid $3 each. I think I'll get $15 to $20 a piece on those. And the last sale I went to, I got this Sony 11-band receiver. It's like this little radio thing for 2 bucks. Didn't look it up, but anytime I find Sony stuff for cheap, I just buy it. 
I got these LeBron shoes, uh, XII, or maybe they're LeBron 12s, I don't really know. Anytime you guys are trying to comp out uh, Nikes, you can enter this code. So this one was 684-593-301. They said they were new, and they definitely look new. I can't find pretty much any wear at all on these. I just have to look them over really, really closely before I list them, because if I say these things are new and they were worn even once, you know what? Yeah, I'm looking inside, and you can see just a little bit of, like, sock residue or something. So I can't list these as new, and that's why I offered 50, because... I'm fine selling them as used. Um, I think they'll bring close to 100 bucks because they definitely are in near mint condition. I almost missed this Tonka truck at that sale. I think when I went like inside the garage at first, they didn't have it pulled out. And then when I was leaving, it was just sitting there. And I was like, this thing is awesome. It was two bucks, it had the canoe with it. And I cannot hardly find anything for like sales comps on this. I think this is really rare. It might not be very valuable, but I don't think they made that many of them. I couldn't find any completed listings. I couldn't find anything on Worth Point. I found one active listing for a similar one. Uh, they were asking 40 bucks for, and then I think uh, just the canoe, somebody was asking like 15 or 20. So I don't know. I'll group them together and maybe try for 70 or 80. I'll just price it up high at first, you know what I mean? And then kind of come down because I'll be the only listing with it. Before I end this video, I want to let you guys know I sold that Canon. You guys saw me pick it up. I think it's been about a month ago now. It turned out it was a Signal Canon, and I paid $100 for it, sold it for $500 plus shipping, and a viewer named Jamie got that. So, Jamie, thank you for the support, man. I hope you like the Canon. Also, I did not go to any garage sales on Saturday this past weekend because I had my first sale here at the shop. It went fantastic. A number of you guys showed up. I want to thank you so much for making the drive out here, and it was kind of rainy during the day, too, so... Weather wasn't perfect, but we sold a lot of stuff, and I think people got some good deals, so I was happy about that. I'm going to do another sale in August, and if you guys want to come to that, I will put a uh, sign-up down below in the description for the mailing list. I don't know what date I'm going to do it yet, but if you sign up for the mailing list, as soon as I know when I'm going to have it, I will send out an email letting everybody know date, time, address, what I'm going to have for sale, because between now and then, I'll be buying a lot more stuff, so I'm going to restock that whole upstairs. That is it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.